I'm Dan Galusha and welcome to another edition of Shoot and Plank. Uh, today we're not going to be doing any shooting. Uh, we're actually going to be talking about holsters. Reason being is there was a gentleman, he was asking about my GX4, my Taurus GX4, and what he could do for a holster. And I know what he meant because my favorite holsters, and I told him, are the We the People holsters. And I'll show you one in just a little bit here. In fact, I'll show you a couple of them. But they don't have one for a GX4. And there's got to be something a little bit different about that because here's mine right here. Right here, your magazine release. You get the wrong holster for that and it will release your magazine. You'll have a drop out and maybe not even know it. Now this particular holster that I have is not a We the People. In fact, I'll show you one. This is the outside the waistband and it also if you'll notice, and I will get it off here, take my gun off. This has got, in fact, I want to show you this anyway once it's off. And you can see how difficult it is to get them off, so they're not going to come off accidentally. There, got it. Okay, this one has got the cutout, as you can see. Now what that is for, is if I had a red dot on there, it'd fit on there very nicely. And like I said, what who makes these is what they call Warrior Land. Warrior Land right here. You might see the logo right in the back. Um, that's the ones that make it. And they're made a little bit different than the uh, others I was talking about, the We the People. And I'll show you what I mean. I still prefer the We the People in, in many ways due to the fact that I like to have them adjustable for a cant. These are not. Uh, I guess you could say you can't can them. But anyway, this one is a We the People, and this is an outside the waist. And you can see the difference. I'm going to show you these up close because what we have here, you can see down here the little ledge right in there. Okay, that fits pretty good. Plus, you got this. Now, this holds to your belt very, very well, holds to everything. And also, Look at the way that the, you got a gap here. That takes your clothing and uh, everything into consideration and fits very nicely. And back here, you've got all sorts of adjustments for that. Again, that's the We the People, and that's the one I've got for my Ruger uh, Security 9. And I've got the Ruger over here because I want to show you what it's on right now. Now this one, the difference. And you can see right here, i get my hand around here. This right in here look how big those are there's only one that's going to hold which you probably need it since this one has two holding areas but uh, it just fits a little bit different a little bit harder to get on and off which I guess is good but I had one of these not this company another company and you see the gap up in here okay not here but right here it's a gap here all right you have to have a gap like that and this one does too it's got the offset you definitely want that offset. Now why? Well, I found out why. I got another holster. I think it was a pain in the hind end. Couldn't get it on, couldn't get it off. It's because there was no gap. It would not go on properly. Your belt wouldn't fit into there. It, it, it was just a royal pain. That's all I can say. And then I had another one that had the little finger release over here on the side. Well, within probably two weeks, that thing got so that it wouldn't work right at all. And uh, this fit so tight that you had to pull it way out to get it on. And again, it just wasn't made right. These would not come off. But this one right here, this Warrior Land, yeah, that works pretty good. You can tell I'm using it for my GX4. And now we're going to talk about the inside the waist. And I've got a couple of those. I've got the Warrior Land and I've got the We the People. And again, most all my holsters are We the People. And no, I'm not sponsored by them. Not at all, because I bought them all. Uh, in fact, what on this company, this Warrior Land, I bought the one I have here, which is the one for, where's it going? Here it is. This is for inside the waist, and you can see how it fits, fits very nicely. Um, and when you put that on, and I'll show you here, you got to put it inside like this, pull this clip out, and snap it down over the belt. And that's how it rides right there. You can see that and you have it on the inside. 
Then you grab this clip, open it up, pull it up, and it comes right off. Same thing with the We the People one. And uh, again, this is a very important point. And I'll show you, just like the last one. Look at the offset, look at the gap that you have between the actual holster and the clip. You gotta have that because you've got your pants, you've got your belt, all that has to fit in there and then it has to snap down right and you'll see the both of them are pretty much made the same there. Uh, they've got that clip that uh, is gonna grab hold of the bottom of that belt. So that's good. And both of those are about equal on that. But again, the uh, outside, they're, they're a little bit different. In fact, it, look at the size of the, the difference in the size of the, the actual paddle. It's different. But, uh, of course, this is a smaller one than this is, too. So that makes a difference. Anyway, those are a couple of them that I use. Uh, like I said, uh, they're Warrior Land and also uh, We the People. And We the People is out in Vegas. And I can't remember where Warrior Land is, to tell you the truth. Like I said, they sent me this one. And that's the one I'm using right now. So I'm going to put it back on. And uh, you can see it. This is the thing here. Now I'm going to bring that up. I'm glad I started to put that back on. See the difference here? On the paddle. This paddle goes all the way to the bottom of this. So it makes it a little easier to put on. This one does not. You have it up here, so when you start to put it on, you usually jam that. So what you have to do is kind of put your thumb like that, and then stick it in there. And there, you heard it snap in. Okay, it's in place. Same way with your, your pistol. There, you hear it snap, you know she's in. And it's adjustable. It has these uh, things right here. This one has two of them on it. But right here, you can tighten them up so that it brings them together a little bit snugger. Anyway, those are some holsters that you can get. And if you're looking for the GX4, the Taurus GX4, like I said, I was originally contacted about. Um, it definitely, it's one that I have found right now is Warrior Land. They're the only ones that have one that I really like that fits good. And the others, I've tried two other brands. And again, they were just too narrow back here. And the one that had the finger release, that thing went bad right away. So you kind of kind of want to watch that. But definitely, if you're looking at them, and you're looking at them online for photos, take a look at all the photos they have, and especially looking down this way. If this thing is right up close to here, and there's no offset, it's just straight as this, don't get it. I guarantee you, do not get it, because you're going to be upset once you start trying to put it on and getting it to hold over your belt and such. So until next time, shoot safe, and have a great day of blinking.